Hi there, this is Ayu, then you're watching me on your favorite YouTube channel. So guys, Christmas is right around the corner and I guess you people must be planning gifts for your family, for your friends or your loved ones. So in today's video, I'll be showing you how to make a personalized musical greeting card. So without wasting any more time, come let's get started with the build. So I'll be dividing the entire project into two main parts. First I'll show you how to build the electronic part of this project. So let's begin. The components for the electronics part are a prototyping board or a Vero board. Cut the Vero board into a smaller size and draw the circuit which I have provided in the description onto the smaller Vero board. It therefore becomes easier for us to make the circuit. Next up, we need a UM66 musical IC also known as a melody generator which although looks like a transistor but actually is an IC. Next, we need two BC548 or 548N pin transistors. We will use these transistors to amplify the tone generated by our 66 IC. Next, we need a push switch to activate our circuit inside our grating card. Next, we need a speaker. The one I'm using is a 0.5 watt 8 ohm speaker. We then need a few wires to make all the connections. So that's it guys, now let's make the circuit. Place the 66 IC in the PCB following the diagram. Next, place the 548 transistors in the same manner. Now let's solder them onto the board. So your circuit should look something like this now. Now take a small piece of wire and connect the musical IC to the transistor following the circuit diagram you have drawn. Do the same for the other connections as well. Now, we will connect the speaker to a circuit like so. Damn. So this is how your circuit should look after connecting all the wires. Next, we will add the power lines to our circuit. At this stage, your circuit should look something like this. Now it's time to add the switch to our circuit. Oh, I forgot to mention that I'm using this 3.7V lithium ion battery to power up my circuit. You can use other batteries such as the CR2032 cell as well. So that's it guys, we are done with our circuit. 
Now let's concentrate on making our greeting card and the final assembly. For the card, we will be needing two pieces of cardboard. Now on one of the cardboard pieces, place the circuit and draw an outline with a marker. Now, take a pen knife and cut around the outline to make a groove for the circuit to fit in. Remove the excess paper and smoothen the base. Now, place the circuit in the desired places and make all the necessary changes. Now, take two white sheets of paper similar in dimension as the cardboard piece. Apply adhesive on the cardboard making sure not to drop any onto the circuit board. Now, place one white sheet of paper to cover up the circuit board like so. Cover the other piece of cardboard with white sheets of paper as well. Next, tape the two pieces of cardboard as shown to make a hinge. Now, decorate your greeting card the way you want to. Now guys, please don't copy my decorative ideas though because I guess the people know why. Thank you guys for watching the video and if you really like the video please don't forget to like the video share it with your friends and of course subscribe to my channel till then take care goodbye and merry christmas and i'll see you in my next video